Hello everybody, in this video I'll show you how to enable brake force display on your BMW. So the ignition is on, the diagnosis cable is connected to the laptop, and now let's switch to the laptop. Now we are on laptop, let's start INP to check if the cable was connected and if the ignition is on, so both of them are active. Now let's close this INPA and let's start the NCS expert here file load profile expert profile start chassis so my car is A19 I will select A89 ok here we need to select a module from where to read some data for the car Ok, the data where it reads, now back, now let's select processes U, let's select FRM, this is the light module, ok, let's change the job to read the data from the module, to code here, edit and listen, ok, execute the job, and now until the data are read, Let's start NCS dummy. Ok, the data were read. Now let's go in NCS dummy. Browse. Let's select that TRC file. Filter. Filter module by trace file. Filter. Let's wait until the module is identified by the NCS dummy. Ok, the module was identified, frmfa.c10. Now let's search for brake force display stage. and here is the brake force display algorithm ok so here is brake force display stage 1 algorithm which is enabled on my car if it's not enabled on your car you can enable it and here we have some lights which can be manipulated when the brake force is detected I have on my car outer tail lights, inner tail lights which can be manipulated Third brake lights, tail lights, and rear fog lights. Okay, so for this video, I will uh, change it so you can he see here this is not enabled. Zero means off, one means on, and three means flashing. So I will change the rear fog lights to flashing when I'm pressing the brake pedal in force ok and the third brake lights also and inner tail lights I will change it to flashing and outer tail lights I will also change it to flashing and now export export that man file let's go in NCS expert let's change the job to write the data to SJ Godiran ok now let's execute the job let's wait until the data are write it in the module Codic indeed, so the data were right, and now let's check on the car to see if the option was activated.